Anthony Furman is also really strong, but Camby is a little bit stronger. Is he really? Yeah, he can deadlift 800. He can put, uh, he's got the world record for axle with 420 on the axle. Uh, and he's got a, um, it's 417 actually, technically. But, uh, and then the same thing with the log. He's got a 420 log or, or a 410 log or something like that. Fucking crazy for a lightweight strongman to have, be that strong, you know? Um, and then his moving events are all really good. He's really good on moving events. So he has no weaknesses. Yeah, I mean, there's like nobody that's doing. He's a lightweight, and is but there anybody weighs, that's doing that he, much around here? He weighs about two fifty five, two sixty though, and it, it, on his his average, like walking around the street weight, his training weight, and then he cuts down to make weight for a tournament, and then boosts up again. That's typical these days, you know. That's that's totally the the norm now for a lightweight strongman to actually be um, heavyweight strongman, but they're not big enough to be like the super heavyweights you know um but it's like they're also you know they can they can they can drop down to 231 and make that weight cut you know what i'm saying i mean that that's just an aspect i don't like about sports like because i when i was fighting too it was always like that and i was like what is what does weight cutting have to do with fighting is how i always thought about it it's like what does this have to do with fighting? Nothing. It's, you're just trying to get into a smaller weight class. It becomes such a big thing when it's like, yeah, it doesn't, but it doesn't have anything to do with fighting. You know what I mean? I mean, do you know who, you know who Justin Harris is, the bodybuilder? Hmm. I, maybe if I've seen him. So he's a coach. He actually coached me for a while. He does, he's big on the, he likes to do carb cycling diets. So he does like, really high carbs and then like medium protein and low fats and he likes to do like high days and low days and you know just tons of carbs though and uh he was telling me though he was like he said he has a system and he could easily cut somebody 40 pounds for a weight cut he, he said it's easy he's all for powerlifting and everything He's like, I could easily cut somebody down 40 pounds, make weight, and they'll be 40 pounds heavier the next day <laughs> for yeah. the competition. That, that can't be good for the body, though, dude, the organs and stuff. No way, man. I, I don't think so. It's that's it's a water cut, dude. He probably <laughs> has him on some kind of diuretic or something, you know? Something. 